about a man who wanted too much, and his name was Babu. the hills of Scotland where it all begins. A story of black magic and of murdered kings. sent to Macbeth his reward to tell him that of Cowdor he was now the Lord 
Across the heath, Macbeth and Banku were returning home. Suddenly, it all went dark and they were no longer alone. Duncan slept, two guards waited by the door. After drinking the poison beer, they soon began to snore.
not safe for us here. I flip it. I With the sons out of the country, Macbeth was duly crowned. Wrapped with guilt, he worried that the truth would soon be found. He wanted to be king forever. He never wanted to go, but he worried about the son of his old friend, Banku. <laughs> celebration. All the laws of the land came to see the coronation. As Banco and his son made their way to the castle, Macbeth's men attacked them and stabbed Banco to death. Banco's son to die that day, but in the violent struggle, the boy managed to slip away. In the castle's grand hall, the lords were having a good time, but Macbeth believed they all knew about his crime. However, none of the guests knew the truth of their house. As they sat there eating, Macbeth saw Banco's ghost. Thank you. 
thank you both for coming. Here. We're both suffered. Horses at the hand of my back. You think not that you can get our I'm sure of it. I think he ordered bankers murderers with. Then let us gather an army together. And reclaim. Have you gathered an army, the doctor came to see Macbeth and told the news that she had taken her final breath. The suffering is over. Lady Macbeth is dead.
Excited by the news, Macbeth wrote a letter home to tell his wife about his future upon the Scottish throne. As soon as the letter reached the hand of Lady Macbeth, she began to plot and plan King Duncan's death. She arranged a victory feast for the following night. To the king and his son, she sent a formal invite.